of an extremely bumpy road. As automation, AI, quantum computing, blockchain and innumerable multinational corporations invade the workforce and take over the global economy, we're looking at a joblessness crisis on a scale never seen before in human history. We don't know the exact figures, but estimates suggest that automation could disrupt between 800 million and 2 billion jobs in the next 10 years alone. This will create a huge amount of economic and political upheaval. How we deal with the joblessness crisis will go down in history as an inspiration to future generations or a disastrous cautionary tale. Let's dive into some of the jobs that are on the chopping block. Drivers. Uber and Lyft hate their pizza delivery driver limo drivers, truck drivers, package delivery drivers, as Amazon and Alibaba litter the skies with drones. Bankers, well, the banking industry, is a major vampire on the productive economy. Pretty much no one banks offline anymore, which means there's a 98% chance that loan officer jobs will disappear. They're estimating nearly 2 million bank job losses in the US and UK alone. Accountants and bookkeepers, tax preparers, nearly everyone I know e-files. And more people are doing so using tax apps. H&R Block now uses IBM's AI platform, Watson, in the UK, most workers don't even have to file because it's done automatically on their behalf. Telemarketers. It's hard to believe. Telemarketers. It's hard to believe America still has nearly 9,000 telemarketing companies. I know what you're thinking. Hallelujah! No more spam calls. But those companies employed more than 500,000 of our neighbours and The Guardian predicts there's a 99% chance telemarketing will be automated in the decade ahead. With the chance of making a cold call sale being so low and the vast majority of people now going online to find what they need, it only makes sense that these jobs will disappear forever. Cashiers. Self-checkout kiosks at grocery stores mean that major chains from Kroger to McDonald's would love to replace all their counter staff with the the let-the-customers-do-all-the-work checkout counters. Amazon and Whole Foods are even doing away with the kiosks themselves. Amazon and Whole Foods are even doing away with the kiosks themselves. The future, whether we want it or not, is self-serve. Online shopping continues to dominate in-store sales. We're looking at a 97% chance that untold millions lose their livelihoods. Travel agents, paralegal and legal assistants, fast food cooks, songwriters, translators and interpreters, librarians, booksellers, coal and oil workers, teachers, expect online schools like iTunes U, Parking meter attendants, air traffic controllers and pilots, newspaper reporters, cinema workers, lumberjacks. If only we could fire the politicians and their anti-democracy corporate backers.